Well, Sevier County real estate remains very much in demand with at least a couple of big sites ripe for redevelopment. One realtor says he's seeing a new trend in the market. WBIR 10 News reporter Sean Franklin is in Sevierville with what we may see down the road. Sean? The Smoky Mountain Palace Theater here off Collier Road in Sevierville has hosted concerts throughout the years. It's on the market right now with an asking price of nearly $10 million. Just across the parking lot here is the NASCAR Cafe. It's been sitting empty and available for years. But one realtor says that that could change with a new trend that he's seeing among buyers that he didn't see 10 years ago. What sits empty now, it's great for legacy acts for classic rock and roll, classic country. Won't be empty for long. Randy Patterson with Kings of Real Estate is selling the Smoky Mountain Palace. If they do go through with what they're dealing with and planning on here, um, it'll be a wonderful combination of multimedia here. He's asking for nearly $10 million for the concert hall. The palace has been on the market for only about four months, and Patterson's already had four offers on it. A little bit of work needs to be done on it. Uh, but for a little bit of work, it can generate a tremendous amount of revenue. It's one of two buildings on Collier Road that could see changes soon. The NASCAR Cafe has been empty for years. And Patterson says more buyers getting in on the market will help that sell along with his theater. And I think the main reason for that is we're seeing a change of demographic of the people that are coming here. A more diverse group of tourists now coming to Sevier County with diverse interests. It's a shift, Patterson says, that's developed since the Great Recession of the late 2000s and the wildfires of 2016. Things are coming back so incredibly strong, so incredibly quick, and the quality is being built in too. The palace has about 1,700 seats here, all of which Patterson hopes will be filled for concerts in the future, or maybe something new. Back to you.